Right then boys, so welcome to another episode of Summer Age Glory, so today we have some of Spock's tokens to claim. So we start off with Leroy Sane in a 7.5k preview pack will be sell for 240k, which puts our account on 260k, which is very, very big dubs. So yeah, um, each photo by the way is 30 seconds, so I'm just going to have a bit of a ramble. But yeah, this account, we completed all of the fodder packs, first of which was the 82+, plus, which was in a bit of an L, no shapeshifters, which are very rare, by the way. A lot of packs where people just don't get them. And um, yeah, so basically, on this account, my aim was to get all the fodder packs and then the 93+, plus player pick. 95+, plus, sorry. Now, for that pick, I need another 15 tokens, 14 tokens. I have... Seven available to me that I can get, and that I probably will get. And then the other seven, I need to get a different point. This was my 83 plus times 25, another L. Or kind of, obviously fodder, but no shapeshifters. And, um, yeah, so that's what I'll be doing. And when we do that, I'll be doing it live, and I'll be doing a stat reveal. Because we all love them, and hopefully I'm going to get, like, Di Natale, or Abadi Pele, or... Uh, who's one of the other good ones, like Tim Cahill, maybe, he's a cool one, or Messi or Ronaldo, obviously, you know, Ronaldo will be awesome, go straight into the team, obviously, so yeah, and then from 84 plus times 25, we get Addy Kane, and that's about it, so again, a bit of an L, all we are taking right now is L's, now obviously after doing all that stuff, we sent most of our fodder duplicates, into 81 plus player a top team of the week packs to do SBCs, but for this time we actually went and completed Martinez Quarter, who's a very good right back from this area, and I'm very happy we've done him. Oh, and by the way, I spent 100k on both of the packs that have come out recently, so on my account I'd have like 400k if it wasn't for spending the money on those shapeshifter guarantee token packs, both of which I got no shapeshifters. And instead I just got two tokens. Yay. But yeah. We push on. And the 85 plus times 20 is no shapeshifters. As you can see, Courtois, Allison, Lloris, Modric, Dabala, Trent, Alba, Thiago, Castiles, Mares, Moreno and Vardy. So basically boys, big stinky owls. However... On the second side of the pack, we get Foot Shapeshift the Heroes Cordoba. Wow. Along with Duke, Benzema, Sancho, Parejo, Koke, and Jorginho, Devlai, and Galaxy. But Cordoba is an elite card. And I am very, very, very happy we've got him. So, yeah. We then move on, we did some SBCs, first of which was Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, and we obviously took the 97 left wing, because he has 99 pace, 98 shooting, really good dribbling with an engine, gets out passing up as well, and he's a very good card, we'll probably be using him striker. I'm talking about tactics, I've done my own for once, if they're good I'll tell you them, and we'll have some gameplay next video, and then probably foot champs, which should be cool, and then I'll probably end the series there. Because, you know, this second account's stacked. But yeah, we obviously took the left wing, even though he's playing centrally. 7 chem, this card's fine. And then we did the 93 plus tots or shapeshifted play pick. Tell me who you would have picked here. Gomez was 100k, Hamjik was 100k, Modric was 260, Laporte was 180. I took Modric because I thought I could do bail. Now, after doing all of the fodder packs, I was not able to do bail. Because I did the other SBCs that I wanted instead. And obviously I didn't get lucky with the uh, high rated fodder that I could chuck in. Like, you know, your Messi's, your Ronaldo's, and obviously the low tier shapeshifters. But we then went and completed Fernandinho. First part, we just got rid of a full gold Premier League team, basically. Pretty easy dub. And then the second one, you needed a team of the week. So I went and chucked in team of the week Dan Juma and a full La Liga team. Fekir, it. it was pretty easy. And then we went and claimed ourselves Fernandinho, who looks like a very good card, very versatile. Probably going to be playing him as my more defensive centre mid, 
in a free midfielder formation, like 4 1 2 1 2 2 or 4 3 1 2 or 4 3 2 1. Then we moved on and we completed a second SPC, and I didn't know if I had enough to complete him, but we did some Team of the Week upgrades, and it turns out we did have enough. So we went and completed the first part, we put in Lukaku, and you can tell I was running out of league fodder because we just chucked in random stuff. Tried to avoid Zaria, obviously, because that's the only online token we haven't done yet. And, um, yeah, and then for the second squad, it was an 83 of a Team of the Week. So we put in Team of the Week LaFont, and we submit that with Jaden Sancho and some random golds from the Bundesliga, basically. And we end up getting ourselves a brand new left back to link to our collar, and it is Marcel Schmelzer of Borussia Dortmund. Now, this card is very, very cool, right? I really like it. But yeah, moving on to the main team, boys. There's obviously going to be more upgrades to come. There's not many we can make now, but there will be more to come with Futties, etc. Now, this team, boys, is stacked. I mean, the only players in this team I really don't like, Emerson, because he's a bit dodgy, Chesney, because he's not a special card, and that's about it. But other than that, this team is end game. Like, this team is better than some people's teams who have had the game since the start. So all I can say, boys, is thank you for the support. Drop a like, subscribe for another episode in the future. We will be playing Rivals, and then Foot Champs will be the episode after. Probably not many highlights, because that's 20 games.